Right. Harry sent this. Mm-hmm. Our uncle Harry, who's not our uncle, yes. if you know what I mean. Yes. Right, okay. So picture this. Paddy is on his last legs. Mm-hmm. He's on his deathbed, okay? He knows the end is near. His nurse, his wife, and his daughter, and two sons are in the house when he's, you know, getting ready to slip away. So he asks for two independent witnesses to be present, and he wants this video recorded because he wants to record his last wishes, you know? Mm-hmm. So when everybody's ready, he begins to speak, and he says, My son, Seamus, come on over. Seamus, I want you to take all the houses in the Coltra. Seamus goes, thanks, Dad. My daughter, Geraldine, I want you to take the apartments in the Malone Road. Thanks, Dad. My son, Patrick Jr., I want you to take all the offices in the city centre. And Bridget, my dear wife, please take all the residential properties on the Upper Lisburn Road. And the nurse and the witness, witnesses are going, what? I didn't think Paddy had 2D. <laughs> How is he so rich? What, what was the wealth? And Paddy slips away. And the nurse says, Mrs. O'Shaughnessy, my deepest condolences. Your husband must have been such a hard-working and wonderful man to have accumulated all this property. And the wife says, property? Property? Nothing. The chancer had a window cleaning room. <laughs> 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 we'll be back in a wee minute <laughs> Johnny Hero here on U105 and Linda is still here now you've gone to see a film by mm-hmm. the way I have to say hello to Dick he, he loved that joke about the window cleaner <laughs> he says first class and Michael <laughs> and Ligonel don't